So we were just at the World War II Museum. Yes. It was really cool, not what I expected. No, really, at all. really well themed museum. Like every area you walk into is like theme for whatever era or event in the war it's talking about and like we did a quick a quick view but like you can do basically start to finish start off at the uh, at the entrance in the main gate they give you a card like a touch card where you can follow the story of a soldier from like the beginning of the war all the way to the to the end and there's little like vignettes and like every section that walk you through like different things you actually pick up the phone and like hear that person's story and there's like little video projections where you would see how they would do like war planning, but they showed like videos on their little projection things. Yeah, I don't know what it's called. They, they project them like right onto the table. So if like you see generals be around a table planning, like there are projectors that project like how they did that on an actual table for you to like follow along. And they have like interactive like touch demos and like you can like do, see like the inside of a cockpit. And there's lots and lots of footage and movies like i i would say every section had maybe 10 to 15 little movies that you would sit and watch even without getting any of the extras for the museum there's a lot right and we went on a friday morning and like we're thinking you know it's a perfect time to go to the museum everybody's at work it was super crowded like bumping into people not able to get down a hallway because there's so many people yeah. in it one um, person blocking the the direction of traffic and then it just bottlenecked everybody yeah. and you were stuck in there like a sardine in some situation so you would just be dripping down sweat it yeah. was bad the ac is not even in the whole place so some some sections are really cold others are really really hot um but of the overall experience i'm saying if you're in here and you're here in new orleans and you have a free two to three hour four hour time spend it's definitely worth it. It was twenty-eight dollars a person. Yep. If you have a student ID, it's eighteen. I don't remember. It's like eighteen twenty bucks, but it was an awesome museum. Like you could definitely spend an easy half a day in there, just kind of exploring and doing yeah. different things. We go through museums rather quickly, so for us it was about two hours. But for an average, I would say maybe like four. If you, just if you sit and watch some of those movies and you do the little like follow the soldier experience it's not required but they do give it to you as just an automatic part of your yes, experience yeah i have the cards to you so the little dog tags so they give you dog tags where you can like share you can share along with it. start your story and follow your soldier throughout the experience so it, it was a little fun little extra thing and then like the the actual passes these are these. Like they give you these depending on your shirt. Mm. They're just like little metally tags that you pin onto your shirt and keep them on. They're they're pretty cool, I think. Probably one of the coolest little tickets that you get. Usually it's a sticker. And for me, the sticker always gets stuck in my hair. So or it comes off. Or yes, this is nice. And then like the museum under construction, so uh, yeah. you can walk through the first three buildings like connected but then for the last two buildings you have to like walk outside and around the block to get to the last couple two but, and it's uh, hot <laughs> it's very hot in new orleans but it, it was definitely a fun and worth i'm glad we went and we took, we took a break from from bourbon street because bourbon street in the day is extremely hot and not fun had like a fun museum experience yeah it was great
forces which I shall make to the world circling battle lines of this war. When they make a mix of nothing attempts to conquer the British Isles. These men at risk in huge numbers, and held in exile are honored for their bravery. But their sacrifice matters little on the streets of Los Angeles.
of the Americans attempt to take the finally pierced the Gothic line. But still, the fighting dragged on. He ate Good purchase in Barry Venture. Yeah, we'll do it again for sure. Most definitely. So, well, until next time. <laughs>